Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. As mentioned earlier, a project is any endeavor to create a product or accomplish a goal within a framework set by the related resource, time, and budget constraints. The first part of this definition states that each project has a goal to accomplish. This goal could be a new physical product or a more intangible product, like a quantifiable amount of research performed. Each project must meet its goal to be successful. To accomplish any project's goal involves work. In Microsoft Project, work is noted by tasks. To complete tasks requires resources. Resources most often required are work resources, which include employees and other labor, material resources, which include materials needed to complete the task, and cost resources, which include any other costs incurred to complete the task. In Microsoft Project, you create the list of resources needed to complete all of the tasks within a project file. To see when the project will end, the tasks required to finish the project's goal must be chronologically arranged. When creating tasks in Microsoft Project, you assign resources to complete the tasks. After entering all of the tasks needed to complete the project's goal, you can then see the end date of the project. This basic project plan is then saved as the baseline for the project. A baseline is the initial project plan. Another helpful feature when using Microsoft Project is the effort-driven scheduling it uses to assign resources to tasks. For example, if a task takes 16 work hours to finish, and you assign one work resource or employee to the task at a given maximum of eight hours of work per day, Microsoft Project estimates the task's duration to be two days. However, if you then assign an additional work resource or second employee to the same task at a given maximum of eight hours of work per day, Microsoft Project recalculates the task duration to one day. This lets you easily change task resource assignments to see the changes the additional assignments have on the project's duration and cost. Project helps you schedule the tasks required to meet the project's goal while balancing the time constraints and cost constraints of the project. The constraints of a project are the limitations placed on the project. Time constraints and cost constraints are often the most pressing constraints placed on a project. Most projects need to be finished within a certain period of time and also within a specified budget. The scheduling engine of Microsoft Project lets you manage these constraints by using resource assignments to change the duration and costs of the project's required tasks and meet the project's goal. In addition to creating and managing your project file, Microsoft Project also lets you print and view project information and project reports for the project's stakeholders. A stakeholder is a party that has an interest in the outcome of the project. This could include other project supervisors, customers, or anyone who needs to know the status of the project. Microsoft Project lets you print the work schedule, task assignments, milestone tasks accomplished, and many other types of information you enter into the program. You can also print many types of reports that summarize other critical project data, like total costs, or overloaded work resources within a project file. These views and reports help you update the necessary participants in the project with the information they require. Now that you have a basic understanding of the purpose of project management and some of the terms and concepts used, you should next examine the user interface within Microsoft Project. Before you create a new project file, enter resources and assign those resources to tasks within a project file, you should first learn where the tools required to perform these tasks are located within the program's environment. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.